Welcome back everybody, I'm JEW, and this is the Minecraft Hardcore Challenge for February 2021. I'm back. Sorry I didn't do a video for January, but I really did not feel like doing cats. So we're going to pick up back with the new year in February for the Bee Mine Challenge. In this challenge, we have to start a bee farm and pick lots of flowers to keep the bees happy. We have to set aside one of each type of flower and put them in a, quote, bouquet, which is a chest, for your valentine. Make a house, build, and incorporate honey blocks in some way. At the end of the challenge, you receive one point for each flower type in the bouquet and one point for each honey block you use in your build. If you are brave enough to try it, five points for a wither rose. Spoiler alert, I will not be doing that one. The flower types are dandelion, poppy, blue orchid, allium... Azure blue it, red tulip, pink tulip, orange tulip, white tulip, oxide daisy, cornflower, lily of the valley, sunflower, lilac, rosebush, peony, wither, rose. Um, the challenge is credited by R.S. Malik and Granny's Got Game slash Isabecca. So that's the challenge, and we'll go ahead and create a new world, and we'll call this uh, Bee Mine. We'll put on Hardcore. Um, more world options. The seed is B mine, just like that. Structures on, standard rules apply. And one other thing that I just learned today, we can implement the... Um, what's it called? We can implement the data pack right to the, uh, to the game without having to do any trickery. So I'm going to drag this right into here. It's the baddies coordinates. And then we do selected and then click done. And as soon as we click create world, it will load up and have our pack. I didn't see any specific coordinates for this one. So we'll just go ahead and jump right in, see what we find and start off this season. All right. And there's already one flower here. We're going to collect. We're going to need a few of them for uh, bees and bee pollinating and all the good bee stuff. So let's go ahead and get that. Also, we will go ahead and grab some food-related items um, and some wood. I probably knocked down a few of those. Uh, what do you call those? Those mushrooms over there? Oh, I see more flower types. Awesome. We're on a good start for flowers then. The other thing you might notice is the microphone, or my voice. I got a new mic for Christmas. Yay. I've been experimenting with different things uh, with the microphone, so hopefully uh, what I've been trying will be sufficient. So let me know what you think. If it's too loud, I'll, um, I'll go ahead and make some modifications in post, and then hopefully it won't blow over his eardrums out. I am doing this one solo this time. Um, last minute, uh, Kyrie messaged me and said, Hey, um, do you want to record the challenge? And that was already uh, Saturday or Friday. And I'm recording this on the 31st to be ready for Monday. And I was busy this weekend, and I had limited time. I said, Well, if you can do it uh, today, then we can do it today. Well, that didn't work for her either. So, we're not doing it with Kyrie this time, and we'll see what happens with March then. But uh, good luck, Kyrie. Um, I hope you the best on this challenge, and uh, we'll see how things go. All right. So, I am going to collect the red mushroom here, and then also the brown mushroom, so we can have an instant food supply of some mushroom stew. Or soup, whatever you want to call it. I think it's called mushroom soup. I could be wrong. Well, I guess we'll find out as soon as we make it, won't we? Uh, do, 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 do. I'll get all this stuff here. Alright. Get that. And then... Here we go. Oh, there goes that. Okay. Let's make another... X. 
and I just did notice it, but the coordinates pack is working. So uh, that's cool. I'm glad that was working like I had hoped. That was a really cool feature. I like that. Just click that data packs option, drag your data pack right into the Minecraft, and it will be there for you ready to go. Fun stuff. Um, now, with a bee farm, you could automate the bee farm. But that would require going into the nether and getting quartz. So that's something that we may have to consider. Um, we did the nether challenge one time. or Well, it wasn't really a nether challenge. It was going into the nether. So we've been in the nether, so it's not that big of a deal. It's just a matter of finding the obsidian to do it. Uh, do we want to fill all... No, I don't want to fill all of our slots up. But I will fill the top row. That'll give us nine. Okay. And then we'll keep those aside for later. Okay. Uh, the next thing we need is more wood. And I see more flowers over there in the distance. Now each flower kind of um, is one point. And then each honey block is a point as well. So without getting the wither rose, the max number of points we can get is 16. The one thing that I do know about flowers, um, the hardest one to get, I believe, is the blue bonnet. And those, they're not really hard, but you have to go find a swamp. I think that's the one, the blue bonnet, I think that's what it's called, and they only spawn in swamps. So that'll be a little hard to find. But right now we have the peonies, the lilacs, and the poppies. And then we're about to have the dandelions. We'll grab these. Wow, there's a lot of those right here. I saw some more in the distance too, so we'll, we'll go get flowers. Um, if we can run across some surface iron, that would be cool too. Just remember, standard rules apply for hardcore challenges. You can't kill animals. Um, we can harvest wool, though, if we find sheep. We just can't kill the sheep for their meat. Oh, you know what? We don't need wool anyway, because another one of the rules of the hardcore challenge that I just remembered is you can't sleep in a bed. So there's no reason to have a bed anyway. What am I thinking? Okay, what, this is the, what, the oxi? Uh, yep, oxi daisy. Okay. Um, the other thing we're going to have to consider is how to get the bees and move them around where we want them because from what I remember about honeycombs is you cannot break them with a regular pickaxe. You have to break them with a silk touch axe. Not a pickaxe, but an axe. Um, I think that's the only way. Now, I may have to go back and look this up because I'm doing this all in memory because I don't typically do bees a whole lot. Uh, there's a flower forest over there. Look at that. Um... Anyway, what I'm trying to say, the B setup is going to be a little um, not difficult, per se. What's the word I'm looking for? Um, grr. Um, not familiar, maybe? So this might be a little bit of a learning thing uh, with me. Okay. So we're getting more flowers here. Oh, lots of flowers over there too. Wow, we must have hit a flower forest. Um, which means that we should also come across some beehives. Let's see. Red tulip. Let's see. We got... Uh, that's not a flower. That's a flower. Poppies. White tulip. Blue it. 
Blewitts, Azure Blewitts, Red Tulips, Poppies, Lilacs, Peonies, and Dandelion. So we've got uh, 8 out of the 16 required already. Oh, well, here's number 9 then, too. Okay. Alright, that would be good. Let's get a few more of these just so we can attract the bees. And feel free to comment if I'm uh, if I'm presenting any of this information correctly about uh, the bees and the beehives and whatnot. I'll go do I'll go do some research about uh, the bees. Uh, we got tulips, okay. We got the do we have yeah, these are these are these guys. The peonies. Pe pe peonies. Peonies? Peony? I think it's peony. Okay. Um, let's see. More flowers. Lots of flowers. We already have all these. Uh, ooh, rose bush. Let's get some of those. Yep, there's the rose bush. Some of these guys. These are the cornflowers. We have ox eyes. All right, cool. Um, we have all of these already. Yep. And you know you get a new flower because you get the little toast pop-up thing. Let's see. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. Ooh, there's a swamp. Look at that. Might be a lucky day. Might get all the flowers. Let's grab this guy. Let's eat a couple of these. Alrighty. I still have yet to make a sword or a pickaxe. I've been concerning myself with the flowers, which is not a bad thing. Whoop. Don't want to die here. It'd be sweet if there was a sunken ship around here, too. Whoop, 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 whoop. The sun is starting to go down, and that means the bad guys will start to come out. So, let's see if we can't find the flower that we want in a timely manner. And then we might go underground for the night, grab some cobble, and then decide a house. Oh, there it is. There's that blue flower right there. If anyone, well, I don't know, if anyone wants to uh, come look at this one, there's a coordinates right there. But wouldn't that be cheating against the rules? Okay, there's creepers. Uh, we've got a cow over here. There's sheep, but we can't really use sheep because we can't really kill them or use their wool. I guess if I wanted to harvest wool for... Um, for part of my build, I could, but I don't see any reason to do that. And there's more of these flowers. What are these? These are the... Oh, blue orchids, not blue bonnets. They're blue orchids. I was naming them incorrectly. Uh, let's see. Is there anything in here? Ooh, iron. There is some stuff in here. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's do this. Uh, let's see. Um, we will... Whoops. Oh, well. Okay. Let's grab up some cobble. And we'll probably uh, just kind of lock ourselves in here. Uh oh Um. Okay. 
Oh, there he is. He's probably going to bring some of his friends along, too, which is not great either. Got him. Oh, baby a zombie! No! Mm, ah, run away. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, um, the swamps are also well anywhere really anywhere in dark is uh, creeper territory and we don't want that whoop 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 and my pickaxe is already starting to go and I'm already starting to lose a lot of health nobody dies on the first day which means we can uh, start over but I really really don't want to no one wants to restart a challenge. Ah! Because again, this is hardcore challenge, and hmm. okay, so we're a little bit in the clear with water because zombies are slowed way down. Okay. Um, let me, you know what, let me just get a whole bunch of more wood here, and maybe we can close ourselves in, uh oh, I hear, I hear more skeletons, no, not skeletons, zombies, mm. you guys think I'm crazy, uh, shoot, come on, Uh, I should probably should have made an axe. Dang it, that would have been the smartest tool to make. But oh well. Okay, he's gone. Uh, I need to go ahead and make another axe anyway. Get more wood. This is not where I want to build my house. I need to go back to the flower field to see if there are indeed um, flowers there. I don't want that. I really don't want that. Um, I'll keep that. Okay. I did want some of this uh, iron, though. Oh, jeez. No. Oh, die. Oh, jeez. One heart. Man. That was not smart. Not smart at all. Um. Yeah. Don't do that, guys. <laughs> <sighs> oh man. Hmm. We are a dangerous territory. Okay, well, I don't know if we can really worry about that iron. I really want it though. It's a flower. You can't mine iron with a wooden pickaxe. You can make it with um, a cobblestone pickaxe, though. Or stone pickaxe. Here, I clicked my middle mouse button again, thinking it was modded. This is not modded Minecraft. Nope. Okay. I could do to find a village. That would be nice. This is bad, too. I've been in this situation before where I'm in a little bit of a hole and the creeper falls around my head. Yeah. Not a fun day for anybody. Oop. There's... Whoa! A creeper. Don't want to go over there. Oof.
Um, is that creeper zombie guy? Zombie creeper? I hope that's all that is. Um, I think it's best if we run out of here. Yep, creeper villager. I wonder if that means there's a village close by. Okay, I am boogieing out of here because I don't want to die. Um, but um, bum bum. I have roses already. I don't need more roses. There's some blue flowers over there. More blue flowers over here. There's a creeper right there. Don't need him getting in my way. And the sun's coming up. Not quite day one yet. Um, my little day counter at the bottom will tell me when we are at day one. Uh, let's see. All right. I think we're, we're getting super close. Whoa! Run! Run, 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 fast you can. Oh, we're getting in the clear. All right. We we are in the clear. All right. So, let's keep running until we hit day one, and then we will stop. And I hope to goodness that I actually hit record. <laughs> I hate to do this whole day, this whole first day off camera, but I'm pretty sure I hit record. I did. Cool. Any second now, it's going to flip right over to day one. And that will be the end of this recording. I'm just walking along. Come on, come on. Day one. There it is, day one. All right. So we made it. A very close call there. Um, don't recommend doing that again. But anyway, this has been JGW. Like, subscribe, comment, and we will see you back in day two. Bye.